For millions of years, the Indian plate has been inching northwards, colliding with Asia and raising the majestic Himalayas. But new research now shows the story is far more dramatic. The Indian plate is tearing apart beneath the mountains. Around 50 to 60 million years ago, the Indian plate began to slam into the Eurasian continent, lifting up the Himalayan range and the Tibetan plateau. For decades scientists thought that the plate simply slid beneath Asia like a solid block. However, a major study using advanced 3D seismic imaging of S waves, known as receiver functions, has revealed something very different. In the western Himalayas, west of roughly 90 degrees east longitude, the Indian plate remains relatively intact and is under plating beneath Tibet, sliding smoothly beneath. But east of about 90 degrees to 92 degrees east, the Indian plate's lithospheric mantle appears to peel away, delaminate, from its upper crust, creating a molten or weakened zone, an asthenospheric wedge, between the detached mantle and crust. That means the plate is not a rigid slab all the way across, it's warping, tearing and breaking apart under the surface. This matters for two big reasons, seismic hazard, the tearing and peeling apart of the plate creates zones of weakness, stress concentrations and complex fault behavior beneath the Himalayas which may help explain the region's frequent and sometimes deep earthquakes. Geological evolution. This changes how we think continental collisions work. It's no longer simply, plate A pushes under plate B. Instead, there's internal deformation, segmentation and deep mantle dynamics at play. In essence, the Indian plate isn't just sliding beneath Asia, it's silently being torn apart, piece by piece, deep beneath the Himalayas. This new insight not only rewrites our geological textbooks, but also urges greater caution and preparedness for earthquake risk in one of the world's most tectonically active zones.